Students from several local universities gathered for the forum to ask the candidates about issues most important to them. Renewable energy, advanced manufacturing, we have to play to our strengths. My job is to make sure I am bringing the businesses to this community that fit the skills that you all leave college with. Addressing a crowd full of young voters, mayoral candidates Desiree Charbonnet and Latoya Cantrell talked about jobs and how they plan to keep these students in New Orleans after they graduate. And we're going to make sure that those individuals hire you guys coming out of school, engineers, people with very excellent skills, putting you to work right away. Providing our people not only with the workforce training that they need, providing internship programs. Latoya Cantrell touted her work as city councilwoman on issues of crime and mental health. I've led on the issue of criminal justice reform. I believe that right size in the courts, but not only that, the funding necessary across the board. While Desiree Charbonnet plugged her experience as judge. I have seen the faces of despair in my courtroom day in and day out. I've seen people sick withdrawing from heroin. You should not have to go to jail in order to get access to drug treatment or mental health treatment. Many challenges lie ahead as the city looks forward to its 300th anniversary, marking a historical moment with the city's first female mayor. That's why these millennials say they care. They hope the new leader will come with fresh and innovative ideas for a secure future. Well, the business community, they need to pony up. They need to offer you more jobs as well. We have eight colleges and universities in the city of New Orleans and two medical schools. You know that. But yet, we don't play to the strength. 